Hello! Welcome to Bomber Cyberfunk, one of my favorite games of last year. So I'm going to be running this game, and with me commentating, I have my friend Chiron. Hello! He also Hello. Hello! There we go, that's the camera says. Come on. Hey. Yeah. Sadly, we did not meet the incentive for the custom sprays. However, I do not like to disappoint people that did donate money towards it. So luckily, I have a little something extra prepared already. I'm not going to spoil what that is, but we'll see it throughout the run. Time for this run starts like when we enter chapter one, and we enter the file. And then that's when all the shenanigans will begin, because there will be plenty of shenanigans. There's going to be a lot of shenanigans. Yeah. Would you like to do the honors on the, on the button, Kai? Uh, yeah, count me down. Three, two, one, go! Good luck. Good luck. So, yeah, so first thing we're going to do into this game once we load in is a, uh, we're going to break out of jail. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's exactly what I think of breaking out of jail as well. Wahoo! <laughs> Oh uh, yeah, so basically what I'm just doing there is I'm slowly building up trick meters. This is use what we use for boost, and we get boost by doing tricks. And that's how we kind of progress through uh, the game and do things fast. Currently, can't quite boost. Cause, uh, but we're going to unlock that ability once we have spoken with our good friend Trice here. Yo, you're not. Nah. He, you're not. Nah. <laughs> He's the one that's uh, broken us out. Everyone, everyone loves the little uh, voice lines uh, that come out. So building up a little bit of a... Uh, Boost. So then after this, we now have a boost pack, which lets us boost. And you'll see a uh, very much that we just go, okay, and whee! Oh, control decides to disconnect there. That's very fun. Let's and as soon as we get to here, I'm going to quit because he's going to run over. And it's slightly faster to quit out and load back in. And a, uh, that's when, and he'll just appear where we want him to be. It's a little bit faster. Luckily, there's not much quitting to menu in this game. At least they are not near the beginning. There's like one section where we do a little bit of it, and then there's one where we quit, quit out, which I, uh, you will see hopefully in a uh, about two minutes, as long as things go well. Because uh, we're gonna go here, we're gonna get skates. This is what lets us like take on and off our sort of like what we're gonna be skating around with. So an and important thing to mention here, uh, Christian has changed his frame rate to 30 FPS to do his trick, as it is exclusive to this frame rate. Yep, it's a tough one to do, especially under pressure, because you slide and get this wall, hold right. It's a very precise trick, so it might take a couple of attempts. But it's absolutely fine. Yeah. You got it, Christian, you're fine. I'm just making sure that things, because I remember there have been V-Sync shenanigans happening before. Nope, that's the wrong button. Come on, Royal. This definitely looks like 30. Yeah. I've not choked this trick this much for a while. And then again, it's back in a uh, thing. But I do know a, uh, another way. Oh, there, there we, we go. Got it. Nice. Just mention that there's another way out, and the game goes, okay, now you can have it. Although here, there's a scary one coming up now, because this there's a uh, sort of a two-minute time save coming up that I cannot retry if I fail it. That's okay. So I'm going to line up with a, uh, this texture here. That looks good. And then I'm going to jump and pause and jump at the same frame. And I need this to double load. If I double load, I have saved two minutes. If not, then we need to do a lot of stuff. This is a very precise trick, so who gets this? No! Well, that's fine. Okay, but it's fine. I, uh, I, I didn't, I've not fully locked myself out. I just missed the input. So we're just going to do the tutorial quick. That's two minutes lost. No. That's fine. That's more time for me to drink my favorite drink. Ah, yes. I think I too will partake in my favorite drink. Have you had this yet, Hugs? No, I haven't. What is uh, that? Is that? Do you want to Oh. I've got uh, a cup boy. Someone, can someone grab me a glass, please? Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> I like this power as host. Well, yeah, if you will look closely, you might see there's some air. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> I've not actually seen some of these yet. <laughs> oh, look at you, Huds. Oh, hi. <laughs> yeah, unfortunately, we now have to go through a long cutscene and a tutorial. There's a reason I get very sad when we do that. So this is why, even though my PB is a 56-minute run, my estimate is 1 minute 10, because this is very easy to mess up, especially under pressure. Would you like some donations to help ease the pressure? I think that will do very nicely. Fantastic. We have a $5 donation from Zola. It says, good luck, have fun. And that went, to, of course, towards the custom sprays. Oh, I have a cup. Thank you. We also have a $25 donation from Trilado. It says, hi, ESA. Have a donation. Thanks for all the entertainment. I'm looking forward to the GTA run later today, and I hope it will be as amusing as the one last Saturday. I'm looking forward to that as well. Yeah. And they also put that towards your incentive, Christian. What on earth flavor is this? This is luminous green. This is guanabana. Uh, pineapple. Oh, that's incredible. Yeah, I know. Yeah, that's no, right? Good. Why do you think we've been posting about this all week? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 
We have another convert. Okay, I know what I'm taking home with me. Drink Festus. <laughs> Drink Festus. That's, that's, <laughs> if, if you don't get anything out of this. Yeah. We're not sponsored by them. We're not, we're not like Festus. To be. <laughs> we just love Festus. Okay, basically, here's what like I've not seen in a while. Luckily, I did practice the tutorial before this in case I failed. Oh, yo, let's go. Romance, <laughs> let's go. <laughs> I've not seen this. <laughs> Uh, luckily, there's the, like with some of these, like you can do little skits where it's like, oh, you need to follow this path. However, there's just boxes in. Oh, is that BB Ian? <laughs> yep. <laughs> that's Linky. Let's go. What's up? One thing I have also done with some of them, I also stretched that one, so it is a uh, it is wide Kai and wide Linky. <laughs> Let's go. Also, thanks to Nordic for a lot of these. Oh, is that skin me birthday? <laughs> 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 Okay, now we're gonna go talk to Trice, and then I'm gonna go do the shenanigan I wanted to do two minutes ago. Because now we have the ability to do sprays, because before we were locked out of it. So the game is currently in an A. Okay, you can do sprays again. I'm not gonna do the uh, fast way because things have not been played nice. I'm just gonna do a slide here, clip out of bounds. Nice. Because we have shenanigans. And so basically, I, instead of going to the so like first area that you're supposed to go to, instead I'm gonna go to the uh, the last. Oh, if, oh, well, I would do it if I don't fall off a ledge. Thank you, nerves. Whee! Yo, nah. Yo, nah. <laughs> huh. hey. Oh, come on, what's wrong with me? You're okay. Whew. God, is this what happens when I don't, when I, I get distracted by uh, Penny's big breakaway coming Absolutely. out? Absolutely, yes, it does. There we go. At least I can, I'm glad I have this safe backup. I just need, I might just uh, play it safe and go for the uh, easier sort of like place to go to. Because, you know, marathon safety and all that. Because they, uh, or just do this. Nice. There we go. I mean, honestly, you messing up these tricks is fine because it gives us more chance to listen to these absolute Yeah, bangers. I love the soundtrack in this game. But yeah, so Rico basically. Huts. Oh, yes, please. <laughs> I'd feel, be, I feel on odds. He never shares his festus. I didn't know it was the thing! There you are. <laughs> Are oh, you talking about Kai never sharing? Yeah. Oh, right. Okay, he never sorry. shares his festive. I was going to say, I can't share. I never bought one. I, I don't mind sharing as long as it converts. Exactly. <laughs> it's a special Sonic speedrunner privilege, Christian. Yes. Ah, I see, I see. Maybe you need to speedrun a Sonic game. I've, I've done Sonic, Sonic Story. I like once. I've done it three times. <laughs> three times. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, here we are now. We're in, now in an area we're not supposed to be in. Yeah, this is technically. Yeah, this is technically. Yeah, this is technically the second area. Like we went, we basically took a shortcut through the last area to get to the second area, because now we can do our our sprays here that we uh, have. And basically, this is how you get reputation, because the goal of this game is you want to get all the reputation, and we want to go all city and like have the bomb rush crew be the biggest crew in the city. I'm not seeing posters for the bomb rush crew, but I am seeing posters for the BSG crew. <laughs> Yeah, just uh, pay, pay attention to uh, all the all the uh, things you see. There, there are a lot. <laughs> so uh, thank Nordic for some of them. I added some in last night to make sure. Is that Big John missing up there? <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about, guys. <laughs> also, we have French. <laughs> Baguette. <laughs> oh, yo. Oh. That's sick. We need to talk no, about that. Oh, Wait, no. does that say glitches are cheating? <laughs> glitches are indeed cheating. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, unfortunately, I went for a uh, trick, but I hit that billboard, which I did not want to do. Because uh, there's a thing in this game that's, that we do a lot called uh, zips. Where if you hit like the top corner of a billboard, you just get a lot of speed. And a funny, another funny thing is that speed gets stored. Which means we can then use it later and not have to hit a corner of a sign of a billboard. And we just go flying. And you will see like where that comes in like a little bit in the next level as long as I don't mess, thing, mess things up. I am going to go for like a very difficult uh, uh, cycle to hit. Oh, hello, blow high. Yo, it's my fella, Blahaj. Okay, this is this is a uh, this is a stressful cycle. I need to be very very quick. Oh. Nice, let's okay, go. Okay, that's if I so I need just need to now make this cycle. Talk to you. Do this spray. Yo, 
Yeah, he made it nice. And there we go. That's Train Cycle. This basically gets us to a lot of sprays, which speeds up the game a lot. I'm not going to do the last one this side because that takes us back. So instead, I'm just going to wrap around and hit this side of the train. And there's a lot of sprays here to a uh, grab, as you can see. And then I'm going to try and set up for a, uh, for, a, for a nice trick that's upcoming. Okay, nice. I'm on top of here. And here's where the big uh, thing comes up. And I'm going to basically see whether that sign that says glitches are cheating. Oh, is that? Oh, I don't oh. care. <laughs> oh, nice. There we go. And that basically takes us, because currently there's a wall blocking us off to get here, which is where the cutscene to progress the game is. However, we just go, if we get enough speed, walls kind of don't matter in the end. And it also... Got, you also saw another example of a zip. <laughs> Sorry, <just> Hi, Nash. <laughs> oh, hello, Nash. <laughs> Lasagna. Yeah, now I'm going to show you an example of storage. Usually to get a zip, you need to be on the top of a sign. But now I have storage because the game remembers the last speed I had on a... Uh... Oh, we're about to do a zip off the bromance. We're about to do a bromance zip. Yo! <laughs> oh, bit too high. Because I want to be down here because this is where the trigger is. Yeah, so I can just do a zip off there, and so we kind of do a lot of that. And because I've hit all the sprays, like, there's just unlocks all the uh, challenges. Because here's, like, another way to progress. Once you, like, have reputation, you unlock these uh, sort of, like, crew challenges, where this one's going to be like, hey, get, like, an eight times multiplier on, like, these uh, rails here. So I'm like, okay. I'm going to end the challenge by landing, and, like, in the fade-out time, grab another spray, just so, so, like, just a little bit of efficiency. Because they go, oh, now it's faded out. And then I'm going to get some more, get a couple more sprays. And then it's just rush to finish all the, uh, you know. That picture I took at Yards is fantastic. <laughs> I only caught a glimpse of it then. Which one is it? It's the one you like doing the same face as the bumper. Oh, no. <laughs> I wonder why you were taking that. I mean, I had another intention with that, but unfortunately, the incentive wasn't met. Oh. There you go, then we're gonna to talk to this guy. Yeah, this one is, hey, do some wall rides. So I'm going, okay, I'm, ah, crap, I was too fast. Uh, I was, wasn't fast enough. Yeah, basically, unfortunately, that spray is bugged now, because uh, one, one of our crew members was trying to do it, and I interrupted by doing a cutscene, and that breaks it a bit, but it's fine, because I know where there's a backup. This is my favorite song in the game. So yeah, so now I'm gonna do another uh, quick tip. Nice. That's a sick way of cancelling, actually. Yeah. Seen that. So I'm going to jump on here. I need to line this up pretty well. They're franking on the blow high. I don't appreciate this. And I'm going to hope I hit the sign. No, I nah, don't. Never mind. But it's fine. I can just quickly turn around. Whee! And that's how you finish it. Because that one is just go to the bottom of the hill, learning some manuals. What like is that? <laughs> <laughs> Better call Nash. <laughs> Nash is sinking over the run. <laughs> He's everywhere. See, so yeah, I'm going to go for a, uh, another zip off this billboard. I love this one if you hit this. Yeah. Woo! So, yeah, coming up, we have like a. Festus! Uh, um, Festus! <laughs> 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 So yeah, here's a there's a, here's like a mini boss fight. Uh, yeah, but we're going to skip for this actually. There's usually like you beat this phase and then a uh, it's like a, a few more things to happen. Oh yeah, and so then Christian's then gonna run into, run this, into corner. this corner. And the boss fight just ends. There's usually like two phases of three hits extra. But for some reason, if you get her off screen and then hold hold yourself into a corner, the game just finishes. So yeah, now we have a score battle, so we have a uh, two, two minutes of a uh, not much. So I'm just going to quickly uh, get some score, and then we just kind of a uh, vibe out a little bit. So, Huds, if you have anything, I'm going to be setting up another storage. No problem. Christian, just a quick question. How long would it take to show off the sprays after the run? Uh, not much. It's just replacing a file. 
Fantastic. So I've been told by our glorious leaders in fundraising and tech that if we do meet the incentive before the end of the run, we can still do that. Oh, nice. So the incentive remains open. And I'm also pleased to say that according to my uh, my screen here, we currently have a two times donation match in progress right now. So I'll get the details of that. We need $450 to meet the Bomb Rush Cyberfunk incentive. But just quickly, some donations for you. Facewell donates $40 and says, always a lovely time. Good luck on the closing night. That one went towards your incentive. They also grabbed themselves an ESA winter shirt. Thank you very much. Nice. So now I'm just going to go get storage again. <laughs> it's King of Chad Minion. <laughs> I'm going to wait for this train because I don't want to hit it and I lose the storage for the speed I'm going to get. So I need to prepare this for the next. So yeah, so now we're uh, now now we just have a bit, of a bit of a dance. You know, what, I'm gonna have a bit of a dance. I have prepared this. Don't worry. Uh, no, my dances. Dance, dance, go, go, go. That that way. <laughs> so while Christian is dancing, I'm pleased to say that we have had an anonymous 1,000 donation for donation matching. It is live for the next 12 hours. Chat, get your donations in now. Your donations will be double from that donation match if you get them in now. Ooh. Put it towards the incentive <sighs> and get it matched. That's a, that's a little bit tiring. I am not made for to dance. <laughs> Maybe you should have a drink. You know what I think? You know what? That's a great idea. I am going to skip this. Luckily, in the community, the community mod we have for like stability and all that also has a turbo <laughs> for cut <laughs> <laughs> Also has a turbo like for these cutscenes because people are like, going, my thumb's hurting after like um, two weeks of playing. Here's my boy. So yeah, drink Festus. Very refreshing. Not sponsored. Hashtag not an ad. Not an ad, but also kind of an ad. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I made a Festus ad for in-game. <laughs> uh, unfortunately, we haven't had any funny shenanigans where usually there are no cars happening in this, in this part of the game and in this area. However, because we entered backwards, cars do spawn in. So sometimes you'll just end up with you in a car, or they'll end up in a car, or inside uh, of a yeah. truck. I was hoping that would happen. Yeah. It happened to me yesterday in a practice run. <laughs> right, if I quickly jump in with a few quick donuts. Uh, yep, that's perfectly fine. We've still got uh, like 30 seconds on this. Thank you very much. Pyro Grunt donates $40, no comment, but went towards the incentive. Zornan donates $100, says, well done everyone on another great ESA, less than three, and it went towards the incentive. And finally, Jumini donates $10, says, looking forward to the Mario 64 non-stop run, and it also went to your bomb funk incentive for the custom sprays. Nice. Perfect. Yeah, look, that's a good point to end, because we have a very big trick coming up if I hit it. It's very difficult to do and very precise. I tried learning this trick, and it certainly was a nightmare to learn. Yes. Funnily enough, Kai, put it... Oh, let's go! <laughs> let's go, Nightmare of the Hood! Woo! Oh, my God. Yes! <laughs> Whee! The HUD's nightmare skip. Let's go. <laughs> oh, there we go. Why does this remind me of an old Windows screensaver? <laughs> so yeah, that's nightmare. Basically, we do a launch off there. We do a zip and just like kind of go flying to the end of this a uh, dream section. I love that trick when it works. It's epic. so fun. Oh no, we're dead. Oh, I love this song. Now, basically, we're like going, basically, DJ Cyber's currently going, hey, do you want to know the truth of this city? Let me go into your dreams and your visions. You will see what happens. And that's kind of how a lot of the story and backstory is kind of revealed. And then you have these cutscenes. You know, it'd be easy if you just got to the point and said, what's going on instead of going through all these vague yeah. sequences. So one quick one for you. Len Tacone donates $50. Our first one is part of the donation match, which means it becomes a $100 donation. Says, all right, guys, let's get those sprays. It goes towards your incentive, and it puts us past $62,000. Woo! <laughs> <laughs> the floor in the background. <laughs> I can meme it legal. The music of this is so good. Oh yeah, unfortunately at the very beginning of this one there's like a lot of cutscenes. 
So I, I also have, a, I have another small, a small like bonus incentive I want to add in. If by the end of this chapter, we can get, I'll, I'll say another thousand, get to 63. Uh, I, I think we're gonna do it. I will show off, because there's one thing that people always know for. We will go see Drip Dog. Ooh. I mean, Drip Dog's good. <laughs> yeah, that's Cry good. Cry just shouted, do it for free. Okay, for that, <laughs> 65,000. Then I'll wow. go see Drip Dog. Make it happen. <laughs> How about we meet in the middle? 62 and a, 62 and a half. No, that's like, no, that's like, that's less than the bottom lowest bound. Did you fail maths? <laughs> well, tell you what, we need I four. I see Drip Dog, to be we, fair. We need $400 more to meet the incentive for the custom sprays. So how about if we meet that? Yo. Yeah. Okay, if we meet the incentive. I drive a hard bargain. Yo. Yeah, Hodge does drive a hard bargain. <laughs> There you go, four hundred dollars more chat. Get them in now. Remember, there's two times donation matching on all donations right now, up to the next thousand dollars. So donate now. Put it towards the incentive. Let's get it met ASAP. I mean, technically, sixty-two thousand four hundred is less than sixty-two thousand five hundred. Exactly. I drive a hard bar again. <laughs> oh, they, they've ruined the, the skin me birthday. No. Oh. Fine, it's yeah. not his birthday anymore. It's his birthday every day. <laughs> it's a birthday. So it's his birthday somewhere in the world. Can, can we get some donations? Happy birthday, scan me. Oh, that'd be great. <laughs> See, I'm gonna go for like a uh, trick. If not, I'm gonna go for a backup of that trick because there's plenty of backups in this game. Didn't get that one. Luckily, if I go to the corner here. Yo, happy birthday, scan me. <laughs> nope, not enough speed. Nope, that's less speed. Come on, I can get this. Because again, you can get the sort of like boosted speed off the corner. Nah, it's not worth it now. Yo, nah. Yo, nah. I might be able to get a car boost off this though. Car boosts are cool. <laughs> I just see Skinny's oh, terrified face up there. <laughs> oh, I love Iron the blue. <laughs> that was for you, Argin. Yeah, that was a slow one. Basically, I tried to get a small zip and then I can just. Slide all the way down that hill very fast. You've seen how fast you can go. I'm not gonna skip. Pepsi man. Pepsi man. <laughs> yeah, I'm not gonna. Usually, I would skip the establishing shots. However, I think it's funny to not do that. I'm being mauled there on that billboard. As we see the Giga Minion as well. Yeah. So now we're gonna. So now we have a the second one. We're gonna talk to the Eclipse crew. We need six to reputation, however, at the very beginning of the run in this area, you saw me running around doing a lot of sprays. And that was basically, I don't need to do that now, because I've already done it. Which is a uh, very useful. So, yes, yeah, so, and basically, we walk where they say, well, they, we don't, they don't like us because we are a man. They want someone with the, the, the woman's touch. Luckily, we go to a cypher, we can change character, and we can now play as Belle, so we get to play as somebody else. Which I really like. I like we get to play as multiple as multiple characters uh, throughout this run. So now we talk to them. They go, okay, we're gonna go over to this new area. I did. I set myself to offline mode before. Shout out to my friend, uh, my friend Keegan. Very very cool guy. God, I I set it to offline mode. I know I did. <sighs> I am very bad at this. Do better. Do better. Oh, is I, that Goosebutt? Goosebutt. That is Goosebutt. He is a good duck. Oh, that's a that's like the worst type of thing where like you get exactly the uh, point of getting the uh, zip storage on a top corner, but you have no speed on a sign yet, so it just gives you nothing. So you go and you start <laughs> running nowhere in the air. Is you mind playing Red M Bear Creek RP now? <laughs> <laughs> oh, I didn't hit that. I want to hit that this because this that a uh, because this vending machine gives us boost. So I'll hit that now, and it gives me boost, so I have that. Usually you can do it so you can just run into it after getting the uh, Solace, our friend Solace, who, who we would usually see a fair bit more throughout the run. However, we're kind of, a, you know, skipping all the story. Damn, what is it? Damn, then again, it is a, it is a Saturday. People, people do be gaming. Unforgivable. Unforgivable. They should be donating money to make a wish. Exactly. Oh, my control is kind of going 
all over the place right now. I do, I do not appreciate it. I need to like get, either get a new controller or a new wire. Oh, all the custom sprays we could have had if they donated sooner. <laughs> I'm so sad. It's fine. We can get it, Matt. We can get it, Matt. Speaking of getting it, Matt, Dimitri donates $25. Says, hi, I came here to support my boy Joshima's later today and for the co good cause on the way. Thank you for your efforts. And Shimsusan.jp donates $10, which has been doubled up to 20 through that donation matching. Says, donate from Japan. Ba -ba 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 -bumper. Ba -ba 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 -bumper. Ba bumper And that one's gone towards the current incentive. $390 remain to get the custom sprays enabled. And you just oh, heard a Yahoo. I did hear a Yahoo. The Don Abriano donates $25, which will be doubled up to oh, 50. Hitting things. Last donation for this event. Had a great time and looking forward to summer 2024. That one's gone to the custom sprays as well. Thank you for your donations. Exclamation mark donate in the chat. Click the link in the pinned comment or esamarathon.com forward slash donate. How much further are we off, Huds? Uh, we need $365 to meet the incentive right now. Oh, that's easy. Come on, guys. We want to see Drip Dog. Let's get that yeah. done. Also, you might have just seen me uh, do a big zip all the way over here. We're not supposed to be here yet. This is a, once we have, like, got a tenth ton of rep in this area, you unlock this as, like, a, okay, now there's more to do. However, we are, we have speed on our side, and everything here is, like, all, is always loaded because it's just in the level. So we can just kind of go here whenever we want. And now I have, like, some of the sprays here. We just kind of go back. Oh. Ah, uh, heck. It's fine. I needed to boost jump for that. Unfortunately, this just mean we lose social. Bestis! By the way, drink Vestis. <laughs> <laughs> there we go. Make that sign. And now we talk to Solace, who has been put up there by uh, the Eclipse crew. Which is a very nice of them. I like Solace. Yeah, we have a couple more crew battles. We have a uh, we have a uh, score battle where we have like a set, a set amount of time to get a you know, set amount of score. Luckily, a uh, we're able to do this one very quickly because uh, it's been very much planned out and rooted. You can have a bit more if you want. No, I'm just looking at the amount of sugar in it. No wonder you love it so much. It's fine. The the uh, what what we call the best one is actually a sugar-free one. It's five times that. <laughs> Okay, that, that sign nearly messed me up there because it dropped my combo. I like it. Yep. Yeah, that's a very quick one. We pick up more sprays. Apparently, glitches are cheating. However, I ignore it because I like cheating. Cheating's fun. Just don't look at Just say, uh, just make sure you don't pay attention to the sound waves of my runs. <laughs> <laughs> at least someone got it. <laughs> Spectral analysis of every run Christian Royals ever submitted coming up. <laughs> <laughs> okay, and now we have the next one, which is a get three times, and it's all about like holding your combo through a. Uh... Oh, didn't like that I did that. Doesn't like that it. Okay, come on, Bell, just get on the rail. There we go. This, uh, this challenge is like usually about carrying your combo to different places. However, you can just kind of keep it there and it does, and you don't need to do it on the extra rail it wants you to go to. So you save a little bit of time if you land on the first try and don't let the nerves get to you. Ah. Uh. <laughs> yeah, so now we sort of like have finished their, all their uh, sort of like crew, crew, uh, crew challenges. We now have to fight the police and we have like another small boss fight against a sniper who we will be uh, trying to evade. Oh. Nice. There we go. Get up on that. So yeah, now we just kind of follow follow him around, get a couple sprays during the fight, hit him there, and like while he's doing his a uh, sort of animation and waiting for the next for the hit to register, we grab a spray to just save a little bit of time. It doesn't save that much time, and then we do another jump on a uh, bus here. You can hit him there without having to get the bus because yay for hitbox is extending out. We're going to get another spray and then I'm going to go for what is like the a very terrible trick that's very inconsistent. Uh, if I hit it first try, there will be a lot of hype for me. There we go, we hit him. And now this is called Escalator. And you'll understand why it's called Escalator if I hit it. Da -da -da -da. Nope, that's not why it's called Escalator. That's called being bad. 
This is like a very weird sign compared to some of them, as usually you need to be right on the edge of the corner. However, this one you need to be like a fair bit amount in. Oh, woo! Woo! I'm going to play it safe and land back here because I don't want to lose that. And I'm going to do this spray. And that's basically it. This is the spray that gets us to the rep amount. Because you see we have a cutscene. And they stand on top of that tower. But we can just talk to them from underneath it. So once we've got that spray, uh, yeah, we kind of we kind of do it. So yeah, this is where they need to make a rush for the incentive. Have we met the incentive? Not currently. Oof. We still need three hundred and sixty-five dollars to meet the five dollar incentive. This is the saddest news. This, this, this is this is very sad. This is the last chance to see Drip Dog. They have probably a minute. Do Alk? Do Alk? Dude, say that one. That's great. Do Alk? Do Alk? Do Alk? Let's go. <laughs> so I'm gonna set up for Drip Dog if someone wants to throw the money in there. Someone wants to donate and get the incentive met in time. And to do that, I just need to do the same thing again. Sort of like go here, go here, bing, bang. Big John is indeed missing. There we go. I am, I'm above Drip Dog. If people want to rush it in, he's above. It. He's literally above Drip Dog. Keeping an eye on it. Exclamation mark, donate in the chat. Click the link in the pinned comment. ESAMarathon.com forward slash donate. Last chance. Meet the incentive now. Meet Drip Dog. See the timer counting down. Also, as you can see, hey, we've now got it on screen. Nice. Ooh. Two times donation match is currently in progress as well. The next thousand dollars of which we've currently taken fifty dollars of it will be donation match. So your donations are currently worth double if you donate here on stream one. Thank you, the amazing people in tech, for getting that up on screen. You're amazing, and we love you. Love you, tech. No, I feel bad, and I kind of want to see him as well. <laughs> yeah. Hello. Woof. <laughs> that would be worth the money. You guys should have donated. Yeah. No. That, that, that's worth it. And now we have a, what I think is like the worst dream section because there's not much you do. And there's like no real interesting tricks in this one. So like in the first one, you have Nightmare. In this one, you have, uh, there's like a cool jump you do. In the third one, you have Nightmare 2. And in the fourth dream, you have Baseball. So it just a hint at some of the uh, tricks coming up. So yeah. So if we do have any more donations that have come in during that... No further donations at the moment, but I would like to also remind everyone that you can also donate by subscribing, especially if you have uh, Amazon Prime. If you link it to your Twitch account, you get Prime Gaming. It gives you a free sub to use every month. Use it here on the ESA Marathon channel or over at ESA Marathon 2. And as a result, you get a free sub. You get to watch the rest of the event ad-free, but we get the revenue from that sub. It doesn't cost you anything, but it will all be going towards Make-A-Wish. So get your subs in. Also, if you've got any spare bits, Get some cheers in the chat as well. It's all going towards Make a Wish. So yeah, that right there was the uh, cool jump I was talking about. You uh, can just about land on the uh, thrust of these, these rockets, and you just and that you basically skip having to do like a uh, detour around instead of just going direct. Da -da -ding. Bish bash bosh. Yeah, this one is very much, very much just knowing the movement. <laughs> Big John missing. No. No, Big John is missing. <laughs> Where's Big John? If you've seen that man, you saw the number. Uh, yeah. Now I think I th honestly I think that the next chapter about today is my favorite chapter. I'm a big fan of this one as well. Yeah. The police are having their discussion. They're going, something's, basically the uh, the white robot is going, something's wrong with this police force, and I'm going to sniff it out. And the sergeant's going, I don't know what you're talking about, which is also suspicious. So yeah, basically after each chapter, we have these introduction sessions, which introduces us to the, uh, to, to the next crew that we need to come up against. In which case, it's also one of my favorite crews as well, is Dotty XC. These, these these guys are cyborgs that just the uh, just go hey we want to dance all the time so let's become robots and dance all the time 
You should have learned this dance. Seems easy. I'm confiscating your Festus. <gasps> How could you do that? <laughs> quickly, uh, quickly, Hud. More. This is, this is hill turn. <laughs> oh, God. I'll give you more if you protect it. That's fine, I will. You can't reach it over me. It's fine. Oh, heck, I wanted a trick I thought I had longer. Heck! <laughs> <laughs> I just wanted to save some of my lovely Festus. Yeah, I'm going to get a quick bit of boost. And we're heading to, to, to the Millennium Mall. Oh, oh. <laughs> I've never seen that one. I have never seen that before. That's hey. never happened before. I said the line, everyone cheer, make the sound. <laughs> anyway, to the mall. Usually we need to do a bit more rep because as you can see, there's a lot of speakers in the way. That's the game telling us, hey, we need, we want you to do some stuff. I'm gonna go, eh, how about instead I just ignore walls. Nice. And that just clutters into the mall because the hitboxes, the uh, trigger for is always active. And yeah. Because we're in the right chapter, we, uh, we we just go. Yeah. So yeah, this is Millennium Mall, like my favorite chapter. There's a lot of like really cool movement that you can do here. This is like a surprisingly tricky jump because we have a ledge, so we can't just do a uh, trick jump out. We need to do that. And then at the peak, like I think it's like frame one to three of being able to jump again. There we go. We jump out. Hey Garfield. Who's <laughs> Bert and Paul? <laughs> I was wondering who they were, yeah. That's great. Yeah, so now we head over, we do we do some more sprays. And now we do, we're back on spray collection. You see all the cool movement we get to do around. We do this small little loop. Immediately go back out to the starting area. Hit this spray. I saw meatballs, now I'm hungry. I love this little trick here. There you go. This is the hitbox just uh, for this next section extends a little bit below. But as long as you jump into it, you uh, just kind of make it and you sort of get warped up. There's a lot there's a lot of that, eh, where you, you where you get your position gets set by uh, a lot of these triggers and like interacting with the uh, NPCs. And a lot of that. So we have a cool jump here. I'm going to try and go for. Nice. That's like the best version of that where you just get launched all the way up. Sometimes you get a little bit of a boost up. And uh, you, you sort of like stagger up onto the ledge. Nice. There we go. Here's an example where we get warped up. So we go through the floor doing that. And now we have like a, 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 an interesting jump where we want to get up here. Yo First that's try. Good. Nice. <laughs> that's, a, that's, that's the YOLO strat. There's like another setup where you just do a uh, trick jump up, jump like with the first frame. And now I'm going to do another jump to skip to a later area, area to get onto this rail. Nice. Grab this. Jump up here. And through there. Because the collision there just doesn't exist. So we just basically, usually we need to go through, we need to go through like a thing where the cycles are never in place for you. But luckily, because we, uh, so we found out that the walls up there don't work, we can just do a nice quick skip. I'm going to take this safe. Because uh, it's like another like tricky jump to hit to get up here the fastest way, which saves a few seconds. So I'm just going to play it a little bit safe and like finish getting sprays because we need to get a certain amount of reputation to unlock the uh, crew challenges in the next area. Because now we have finished this. Because what we did there, we kind of blew up the circuitry to unlock these doors. This is what graffiti can do in this game. Yeah. I, I don't know what I don't know what they put like he's blown up a helicopter already. You now it blows up circuitry. Here we have like a uh, a 50 a 50 like combo challenge. However, I'm going to try and incorporate some extra <laughs> stuff into this. You've had to go off Linky, let's go. <laughs> it's a zip Kai, don't be rude. Oh, sorry. Wrong trick name. <laughs> yeah, we people used to used to think they were funny and they had, they had a different name that is a little more inappropriate <laughs> than they, than just a zip. I thought we decided this is now the bromance zip. <laughs> the bromance zip. <laughs> the bromance zip. So yeah, I'm going to come to get to this red carpet because this basically refills your combo meter, as you can see at the bottom. So I can just like spam tricks. I get a trick I do, and then I get a slide for the combo. I do a trick, and then I repeat it. And now I have 50 combo. And I also have zip storage. 
And that always means shenanigans. I like shenanigans. We love shenanigans in games. Oh. Wee! So yeah, I'm gonna try and hit something. It's a difficult one. It's a difficult trick to a uh, hit. It's like very precise. We get the spray on the book on the uh, on the bromance. <laughs> <laughs> Sponsored by the Bum Rush crew now. Yep. So now I'm gonna get on here, and I'm gonna try and line up. <gasps> hit the end on the blow, this time. Huh? Oh, and get that show. Whee! <laughs> very nice. That's a uh, yeah. You just need to get the zip. Avoid all the all the collision. Don't hit the uh, rail. Because you hit because like jumping off a rail sets your speed back down to lower, which is annoying. But you know we're gonna do it. We we hit it. I'm very glad I did it. That's a very fun jump. I think I must have missed a sp spray somewhere. Luckily there's lots of sprays around, and I know where there's a big one. I thought I thought a thing. Luckily I don't need spray uh, spray storage. Did I just see Argic boss? <laughs> um, I'm not too sure. <laughs> I'm not too sure either. I I have only looked very briefly. <laughs> oh, you did. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that cursed Sonic outfit. So yeah, again, this is another another score a uh, score battle. Like, this one's a small one where you have like less less time to where you do it. This one gives you a minute and a half. I'm just gonna chain a bunch of these big tricks together and then build up combo. Because uh, if you sort of like turn into a corner or and ride on signs, you can see that you get like a big boost to your score. Time for being quiet. I'm just vibing out to the music. It's so good. Actually, no, I know. Actually, I know why I missed spray. I was supposed to get that spray after that zip, so I'm back where I should be. <sighs> Amazing what nerves do. Okay, while you're heading there, we've had a donation from Y2KY. Donates forty dollars. Donation matched means it doubles to eighty dollars. Who just says honk, honk, honk? Grabbing themselves a Goosebutt shirt and putting it towards the custom spray incentive. We need $325 before the end of the run to get that met, and we can show off the custom sprays at the end of the run for you all. This one. I love this track. Deep. Yeah, this one is just slide, collects all the boots. This again <laughs> is showing you all that. Oh, hello, Huds! <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, so now coming, we have like another another fight, fight section uh, after this, where it's like, hey, we've been doing a lot of graffiti. Try to work out what that one's covering. Yeah, so they run away, they lock them, so they, they kind of like lock the doors. Now I'm going to try and group them up. <laughs> <Excuse me>. <laughs> <laughs> so now I'm going to try and group group them up, because the way you take out a large chunk of these is you do a trick, if I don't get, sh if I don't get shot. Is that you throw them into the air and then you spray them and it kind of you can see how many it takes out. If I get lucky, I can get these. No, stay. There we go. Getting them in two cycles isn't too bad. And then, because we've been doing too much graffiti, they send in a giant robot to tackle us. Luckily, we have the ra radio. I don't know. I don't know what it is. It's like radioactive spray paint to uh, do this much damage to a robot. I love that they uh, kindly put on some convenient grind rails for you as well. Yeah. Yeah. And luckily, uh, it's possible to just... Usually, you have to like take your time. You go up one arm, it'll slam. You go up the grind rail. You hit it. You then slams another arm. You go on the grind rail. And then it'll slam with its a... Uh, with the uh, length of that... Chamber? I, I don't know. Gun, the, the tank gun. They slam that into the ground. And then a, uh, you go up there to get the last hit. And now I need to try and get a lot of speed off this. Get the zip off Linky again. Ah, didn't get the angle. I've got the speed though, which means I uh, have it. There's a backup we can do where I don't need to hit the top corner. I can just do a storage jump. This is a uh, very precise one because you need to have a good angle for this. Oh, going off you again, Hud. <laughs> oh, brilliant. 
No. There we go. That's the power of bumpers. And then here, this now we zip through to basically the end where they are. We get this cutscene. They're like, oh, hey, we'll open up now and we'll let you challenge us. And luckily, oh, hey, we're right here already. It all, it lines up so nicely. So yeah, so now we have another score battle. So, buds, any messages, any things? This is a always a good point to a... Uh, Absolutely, yeah. Just let you know, we are still trying to get that custom spray incentive met. $325 to go. And just a reminder, as you can see there on the overlay at the bottom, we have a two times donation match in progress. $1,000 has been put on the line by a very generous anonymous donator, which means if you go and donate right now, it's going to double your donation. So get your donations in. Estimation mark donate in the chat. I'll click the link in the pinned comment. Why not throw in $40? Grab yourselves one of our great t-shirts. We've got the Goosebut one. We've also got our limited ESA Winter 2024 t-shirt. So, yeah, get on there, donate, grab a t-shirt, put it towards the incentive as well, because you can double dip this ESA. You can grab both a reward and an incentive with the same <laughs> donation. <laughs> Lovely picture of Laura there. Not a bingus. <laughs> no bingus. So, yeah, basically, more shenanigans set up once I hit this. Uh, I don't trust that. All the... Oh. The game is deciding to lag a little bit. I'm not a fan. But now I am like really against time. Luckily, I uh, know like how much score I need to get to a uh... get up. This is not looking good for me. Okay, get up. That is very much not good. Still got 30 seconds, man. You got time. Yeah. Luckily, it's just here. There we go. That's hey. good. That's the that's the kind of zip we want. That you that should get me enough for the for the next trick. Now, if we get $1,000 in the next 18 seconds, Christian, I'll show you Mr. Weenie. <laughs> Do I want to know what that is? Go show him the weenie. Oh, no, I don't have them speed. No, no! Mr. Weenie. <laughs> oh, well. Oh, by the way, I have, a, I have a question. Have the fins been damp recently? Have the what as well? Have, have the, the fins been damp recently? Yeah. Yes what? or no? Have the fins been damp? Sure, uh, why not? Have the fins been damp? That's great. <laughs> what? I'm very glad to hear. <laughs> I'm really bad to hear about your fins, mate. <laughs> You're welcome. I thought you were speaking a different language for a second. Anyway. Oh, Festus! Festus! Woo! Okay, now we're setting up for a trick called Nightmare 2, which is like the first nightmare, except again. I love the baguette. Come on. No! no! Where am I gonna spawn? Where am I gonna spawn? Here, uh, okay. Basically, I'm possible to get to the end of the level with that. However, um, luckily. I mean, luckily for those fish, they're getting their fins down. Yeah. However, I can still do do it. Do a funny. Though I can still do a funny. Usually, there's like a fight area you need to do to a. Uh, Unlock the next area. However, if I go all the way around here, go up like that. There we go. That gets me around a trigger. The fight doesn't activate. And I might go, oh, hey, but that door's locked. What are you going to do? <laughs> all the lore and luckily, with the, with, the, with the help of our good friend Laura, it seems, I'm able to do a shenanigan. Where as long as this goes correctly. Yeah, it was easy. <laughs> we do that. We jump down here. Oh, hey, look, we're on the other side of that door. Woo! Woo! I like when things go, when you do things on like that first try and it just goes easy. Because it does feel easy at that point. Have we got time for a quick donation? Would you say? Uh, possibly. Excellent. In which case, we have $40 from FOAS getting donation match to $80. Says, great watching the Cyberfunk run, Christian. Kept my eyes pure after finishing the game casually, and it's been absolutely mind-blowing watching some of the strats you've been performing. And remember, chat, drink more Festus. Yes! yes! <laughs> Let's go! Grabbing themselves an ESA winter shirt. Thank you, FOAS, that, for that wonderful donation. Nice. You might notice we're now playing as Trice. We're playing as another character. Like, we didn't choose the Switch. We just can't switch to switch to red at this point. Who is the character we have been playing as? Because uh, at the end, in like the cutscene that we like skipped, uh, he gets shot in the head, so he's kind of out of commission right now. He'll so, yeah. recover. Yeah, he gets bad. We can you you can recover from a bullet wound, right? Ah, uh, no way. Uh, 
unfortunately, you, it's possible to get another zip off that sign. However, it's a really difficult to hit and get to. So instead, we're going to go through and just do casual movement. But then we're going to do not casual movement because we need to go to the pyramid. And usually to go to the pyramid, we need to talk to the Flesh Prince, who's the guy that fixes Red. Because, you know, he's a, he, he's a master of the flesh. He can help people and put people back together. That's, that's kind of his thing. However, we don't want to do that because that's slow. Luckily, this counts as the same area as the pyramid. However, however the, uh, we're not at the pyramid yet, so we need to kind of avoid out. But to, to make sure we do it properly, we make sure that we do not touch the ground for that long because it doesn't set our void out point where we are. Instead, we void out to the default, which is at the pyramid, and we save a lot of time. So welcome to the pyramid, my least favorite level in the speedrun. Because this is so difficult. So I just want to say as well, I was trying to learn this run. Uh, pyramid is the reason why I do not run this game. Yeah, he learned the run. He learned how to do pyramid and went, no. No, I'm okay playing Billy Hatcher. Shout out to Billy Hatcher. Just like us, trying out Stray unrestricted and then cowering out because of sleep paralysis. It's an awful strat and you know it. It is the best strat and you know it. <laughs> yeah, when you can get it. Oh yeah, but it makes it, I said it earlier, there's a, a couple of times when we quit out. This is one of them. This is spray duplication, where if you sort of like quit out after, after doing a spray and during the animation of it zooming out showing you, it doesn't do the spray, but it gives you the reputation for it. So I'll come in, I'll do it again. I'll quit out again. And then we'll go in again, and then we're going to get, we're going to have a, a nice hefty amount of a uh, reputation to work with. It's only works because you spawn right next to the spray. Usually, yeah. in a lot of places, it doesn't actually. Yeah, work. that's the only reason this is fast, and it's why like we don't just do find a big spray and duplicate all the time. We I'm like right there, so it just works out. We're gonna do what I call it. I think it's a really annoying film. I do love the art that um, this crew has. Yeah. Ah. What are they called against Devil? Is it Devil Fairy? Devil Fairy, yeah. yeah. That's 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 a real like tight and annoying jump to a uh, get. There we go. Second try. I'll take it. Yo, new drip. New drip. Oh no, they graffitied on Laura's face. No. <laughs> <laughs> okay. This is where I need to. This is where I really need to focus up because I have to do get a lot of sprays in a very small amount of time. Ooh. That's, not, that's not that good, because now that is very slow. I am gonna barely gonna make Protect the, uh, your woos. Hold off on the woos for now. Okay, I should be able to get most of the sprays. Okay, glad I hit that. As long as I get the sprays, it's fine. I won't lose too much time. You can see the timer at the top ticking down. I need to get like a set amount of score and get all these sprays. So uh, it's kind of it's kind of tight. <laughs> if you can't tell, there's a there's a reason why like this is my one of my least favorites in the run because of like just how uh, stressful it is. Oh, no, I missed it. That no. last one's really hard to get. Okay, yeah, I really. Oh god. Okay, I won the thing. So basically, I am down some sprays, but I can uh, I can pick some up. I can just go redo it now. I can just grab grab that spray, come back. Failing the challenge is where you lose it, because then you need to do that minute again, and it is not fun to do. How, luckily, I know where. To, actually, no, I have a quick, I have a quicker backup than doing that. I just grab these sprays. And that way, I don't need to go all the way up. I have also lost a bit of time because uh, we set up a warp to just warp to the end of this battle. Uh, this next one, which is a, uh... hey, race me to the end and get that spray. 
we spray here, we do this one. We luckily it's a very easy race because you know with speedrunners we go fast, we go wee. Ah, uh, didn't hit get them all. It's possible to get all six of these in one if you get your timing right, although it is very difficult to do. There we go. Uh, and sadly, I need to do another thing again like that where I, uh... No, have, during a score battle, I have like a minute to get all the score needed. And it is... Tough. Anyway, up here, we're kind of just cheesing this. It wants us like to go up and down these three. However, we can just like follow that. And it gives a very nice line to just hit all the triggers it wants us to hit. And it's it's easy. Okay. Now's the big one, because it has the tougher setup and the tougher launch up. I get a small boost off that ramp, so I'm going on and off my bike here because it conserves a little bit of speed to a uh, to do that. Is that bike exclusive or is that? It's just any of your a uh, like things you skate on. That picture of Nashlax is terrifying. <laughs> Probably by design. Yeet. Woo! That's sick. Nice. Okay, I'm up. Okay, so now I'm a, now I'm against the clock. I need to get all these sprays, set a spawn point, get more sprays, and then I uh, run my way and make sure I do not, I'm not on the floor at the end of the battle. Otherwise, a uh, bad things happen. I hate this section so much. Ah, oh, that's not good. See, so yeah, I'm gonna set my spawn point here. I'm gonna do a lot of bunny hops to sort of just make sure I don't reset it. I'm gonna grab this spray, okay. I think I have it. You're gonna see me just get a lot of combo here. Get this spray. Yeah, I should have it. It's all about just staying off the floor now. Yeah, I have more than enough score. Nice. Let's go. Well, there we go. Just in That's time. It. Just in time. There we go. And I was going to warm me up here, and I'm instantly going to jump. Because I now have a my void out point, like, saved at the top. So I'm now just going to do everything I can to not reset that. There we go. I don't think I said it. I was thought I wasn't on the ground for long enough there. So yeah, I'm going to do the same thing again. I'm going to jump. Now we have another thing where we have to fight three police helicopters at once. Again, my main focus is do not set your void point. You're too slow. He's doing oh, all right. I'm doing okay. I made it in time. There we go. The treble. I, look, I think this is like one of my, so like this is in the most popular track. I do think this on the slab. But oh, it just hits so different. So yeah, so I'm gonna do that, I'm gonna hit, and you're gonna see me do a sort of void out now. And as long as I didn't hit the ground for long enough, I'll appear right in front, I'll just be able to mash talk. And uh, we'll just kind of, we'll just be there. And I'll be like, oh hey, you can do it now. Hello, no, that was the last game, Trice. <laughs> yeah, that's why I made that joke so long. <laughs> Okay, so now we're in the score battle. I did it. We did the fast. Let's go. That donation was wrong. And now I need to rush and uh, set up another void out. There's a lot of this. Because of how vertical this uh, uh, this level is, a lot of it is setting void outs, making a lot of difficult jumps and timing everything to, to there. How's the incentive looking, by the way, Huds? The incentive is currently at $775 out of the 1000 needed because Kurthar just donated $100. And remember, that's getting donation match, so it's doubled up to $200. Says, good luck to Christian and the rest of the runners on this last day of ESA. Let's make some wishes come true. 
and wishes come true we will be making. We currently sit at $62,739 raised. Let's get a few more donations in. Let's meet the incentive and hit 63,000 before the end of this run. I just want to add as well that all the custom sprays have been hand drawn by me on a mouse pad over the course of this event. Um, oh Lord. So <laughs> please don't, don't make that be in vain. <laughs> this is proper Microsoft Paint artwork. Yes. Yes, it is. It is beautiful. It is glorious. And I'm going to try and reach a million points on this last, because this is the last score battle we'll see. You might be thinking, well, there's a fifth chapter, and at the end of every chapter, there's a score battle. What about that one? Yeah, we skipped that one. Don't worry about it. Yeah, and a million points easy. Luckily, there's a lot of places where you can just like get a lot of things. I'm going to set a warp here, because I want to uh, spawn up here. And I'm gonna, then I'm just going to chill on a rail. He's chilling on a rail. Chilling on a rail. We enjoying the running the audience? Woo! Woo! Good to hear. Get yourself a drink, Christian. True. Now, now when I can see how much time I have, I won't miss out. Do you need a refill, Hud? Oh, I'd love a refill. Thank you. Why, Christian, what, what are you drinking? I am a drinking lovely Guanabana Pineapple Festus. Oh, funny. That's so am I. It's delicious. Oh, it's, it's delicious. You know what? So am I. Wow. <laughs> see, again, mashing jump to a uh, not set, have my spawn point reset back down. Because I want to jump and, he should, and this will just put us in the boss fight. Oh, hello, boss. Where we fight DJ Cyber. Well, yeah. There we go. I'm just gonna take this nice and easy because this is a because this boss fight is a pain if you uh, if you lose him, especially in the next phase. There we go. One more hit, and then it then it comes down to the uh, do I get the fast strat or not? Four. Get him there. Okay, get him there. So he's pausing here because he can then just get back-to-back -back consecutive hits here on the boss. Yeah, because the uh, his invulnerability timer counts down. There we go. I got the last hit there. His invulnerability is no. I got a sec I got the hit there. I heard the sound. Okay, I'm just gonna do the uh, one of the old ways we had of doing it where he's gonna. No, he turned around. Oh yeah. I went too fast. See, this is the thing, because he dropped his mines everywhere. It's fine. Hit him. There we go. Not the best, not the worst. <sighs> okay. And now we have... I'm going to attempt the most... in one of, one of, if not the most, inconsistent strats, which is baseball. Let's go baseball. So I'm going to get a little bit of boost to make sure I have enough to get over here. And it's called baseball, not because we play the game. Well, we do play the game baseball. But there's no baseball bats. There's just wind turbines and us. We are the, we are the ball. And if I hit it, you will understand why. Also because people found out a way to do it funny and say, Oh, hey, we can use different baseball terminology depending on where you land this trick. You see, if people know speedruns and they know games, they see something spinning like this and they know exactly what's going to happen. Yeet! Yeet! Oh! 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 oh, oh home run! Oh my god! <laughs> Woo! Let's go! Home run at ESA! Woo! I'm just gonna say this now. I've watched Christian play this game a lot and I've never seen him hit this trick. <laughs> he no, always misses. No, I've hit this twick, trick once and it was in my submission video <laughs> to ESA. <laughs> That's the only time I've actually hit it, like in an actual run. <gasps> That's so stressful. I'm so glad I hit that. That saves like a minute, minute and a half. That just doing, just a, uh, doing that. And now we're going to the last area. We are deceptively close to the end of the run. Because you might think, oh, we've got another chapter. Then all the chapters have taken like a little bit of time, like 10, 10, 15 minutes each. Uh, no, we, we, have a, we have a nice skip here. Uh, so yeah, we're going to do something called Updog. Wait, Updog? <laughs> Not much, what about you? <laughs> uh. But unironically, that's what the trick is called. They, uh... Well, basically, yeah, we go very, very up, and people decided to be funny. I love this trick. I did learn this one. Oh, I love this song as well. Yeah. I mean, I love all the songs, but this one, it hits different. Oh, my control decided to not work. Oh, oh I worked around it. <laughs> Woo! Nice impro. Oh yeah. By the way, this is this is the, that's the cutscene that leads us to the final stage of the final boss. It very much is a. Oh, you're at the end of the game now. Ah, oh God, I hate this final boss. It, it's, it can be so inconsistent. There is a fast strap, but I've been, not been very lucky with it recently. 
where you need to where to go fast you need to land on a certain rail at a certain time and it's very very difficult to a uh, hit. I have enough boost to a uh, uh, to make it across. So let's go. Let's see how this goes. Whew. This is this is the final boss. By the way, the character we broke out of jail with that's who this boss is. It's a uh, a uh, that character is called Bo. Come on, come on, come on. There's like a slim chance. No! Oh, I'm going the wrong way. Oh yeah, so the guy at the start of the game, he's the antagonist. Oh yeah. <laughs> we should explain that. We probably should have. And also we've changed our appearance as well. Yeah, okay. Actually, I might be able to get the fast cycle if I... So the good thing is, I mean, if you've not played this game, luckily we didn't spoil it for you. <laughs> that much. Okay. Okay, come on. This might be it. I might have I might have saved it. Nice. Nice. Okay, come on. I should hopefully delete it enough. No! No! no. I missed the final hit. Oh well, we got basically all but one. But it's fine. It just means I just need to waste a bit of time to a uh, Get back. It's an annoying jump because the camera on this boss fight is very, very not fun to work with. Because, like, you, we can't move it, but we're just kind of, like, stuck with the angle that we get. Luckily, I can hit this. And then it's just a case of getting the final hit. The time will be when I hit the final buff. Do you want me to hit time for uh, you? Yep. Uh, I didn't get the fast hit. So now all I do is I Easy. run up. I run up, and I hit the boss. He's gonna turn around and be like, oh, there you are. I'm gonna be like, no, too bad, time! <laughs> Woo! Underest- oh god, after that start, I was so scared of being overestimate. Nicely done, Christian. Oh, so scary. Very good one. Very good one. Oh, you enjoy it? Woo! The question is... I'm afraid to say we haven't met the incentive. Uh, I'm very oh. sorry. We did have one final donation come in from April from Make a Wish. It says, catching up from the airport, go ESA go, cheering you on from my travels home. Thank you very much for that $10 donation, April. Thank you, April. <sighs> Thank you very much. It's sad we didn't meet the incentive. However, I'm glad the run finished underestimate. I'm glad I hit baseball because that time then would have been closer, very much closer to the 110 mark, <laughs> if not worse, because I would have then fallen out, lost more time, and then had to redo the level again. That was, it was an amazing run. Have you got any final shout outs at all, Christian? Yeah, you can follow me on Twitch at twitch.tv forward slash Christian Royal, spelt. You can't see him. You can see it there. I can actually see the. Nope. That's, uh, that's the table, mate. <laughs> yeah, yeah. No, I the table's in the one. way. There, there, there it is. My name there. And, uh, yep, drink Festus. <laughs> Woo! Thank you very much. Right, that's all from me. We're going to get set up for our next, well, not really a runner segment. We've got a glorious segment coming up. So I'm going to hand over to Nordic over at the hosting desk.